guilty of treason except himself, and now to drag in the very military, the very establishment that uh, he has been a darling of, I think is extremely dangerous to pit this. Um, a civil military tension is nothing but a selfish, a very, very loose, feeble uh, you know, grounds to save his face, and it's not going to work. Right. Are you surprised uh, with the way things have panned out over the last few days or did you expect Imran Khan to find himself in this position? I'm not surprised by anything that um, Imran does. Uh, you know, I, I've known him for a very long time and long before anyone else I saw through him. It took me uh, a lot quicker to see through him. Everything that I know of him, people are seeing it now. Uh, I, I see him as a very um, um, selfish person who will put his motives um, above the, the national interest, above uh, the interests of the people of the homeland. And I think everyone is seeing that um, now. It's, it's for, it, it's, he's exposed himself. He's been his best expose. And I think that um, I'm not surprised with the way this is dragged out. I mean, he had a chance. Look at what's been uh, working out in the last uh, month or so. So what, what happened a couple of nights ago when he offered the Reza Lahi from the PMLQ, the CM ship, and offered it in in return of a resignation uh, from uh, his Vasim Akram plus uh, Usman Buzdar. He could have done that ages ago. He could have done that uh, before 10th of March, but he didn't. And uh, so this was uh, a last minute effort uh, to, to again save his Sherwani, his chair. And I think the way he's uh, played, he could have um, done this with a lot more grace. Obviously, we've known for a while that he's been asked to politely step down, offer his resignation, but he didn't want to do the graceful thing. Grace is not something that I equate with Imran. And I think even this, this uh, afternoon, what has happened, uh, the, the quiet meeting with uh, the chief of army staff, the DGISI, the visit to the prime minister house, uh, just before an announcement that uh, Imran was going to address the nation, I think is a little